my dear friends if you have not subscribed to our channel please to subscribe like share and comment let us now listen to the word of god this is gospel reading for today catholic mass readings and gospel reflection for november 2 2024 saturday all souls day the commemoration of all the faithful departed first reading a reading from the book of wisdom chapter 3 verses 1 to 9 the souls of the just are in the hand of god and no torment of death will touch them in the eyes of the foolish they seem to die and their departure was considered an affliction and their going away from us a banishment yet they are in peace and do in the sight of men they suffer torments their hope is full of immortality troubled in few things in many things they will be well compensated because god has tested them and found them worthy of himself like gold in the furnace he has proved them and as a holocaust victim he has received them and in the time of their visitation they will shine and they will dash about like sparks among stubble they will judge the nations and they will rule over the people and their lord will reign forever those who trust in him will understand the truth and those who are faithful in love will rest in him because grace and peace is for his elect the word of the lord thanks be to god response real psalm your response the lord is my shepherd there is nothing i shall want the lord is my shepherd i shall not want in verdant pastures he gives me repose beside restful waters he leads me he refreshes my soul your response the lord is my shepherd there is nothing i shall want he guides me in right paths for his name's sake even though i walk in the dark valley i fear no evil for you are at my side with your rod and your staff that give me courage your response the lord is my shepherd there is nothing i shall want you spread the table before me in the sight of my foes you anoint my head with oil my cup overflows your response the lord is my shepherd there is nothing i shall want only goodness and kindness follow me all the days of my life and i shall dwell in the house of the lord for years to come your response the lord is my shepherd there is nothing i shall want second reading a reading from the letter of st paul to the romans chapter 6 verses 3 to 9 brothers and sisters are you unaware that we who were baptized into christ jesus were baptized into his death we were indeed buried with him through baptism into death so that just as christ was raised from the dead by the glory of the father we too might live in newness of life for if we have grown into union with him through a death like his we shall also be united with him in the resurrection we know that our old self was crucified with him so that our sinful body might be done away with that we might no longer be in slavery to sin for a dead person has been absolved from sin if then we have died with the christ we believe that we shall also live with him we know that christ raised from the dead dies no more death no longer has power over him the word of the lord thanks be to god the acclamation alleluia alleluia come you who are blessed by my father inherit the kingdom prepared for you from the foundation of the world alleluia alleluia gospel a reading from the holy gospel according to john chapter 6 verses 37 to 40 
Jesus said to the crowds, Everything that the Father gives me will come to me, and I will not reject anyone who comes to me. Because I came down from heaven, not to do my own will, but the will of the one who sent me. And this is the will of the one who sent me, that I should not lose anything of what he gave me, but that I should raise it on the last day. For this is the will of my Father, that everyone who sees the Son and believes in him may have eternal life, and I shall raise him on the last day. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Today's Gospel Reflection All Souls Day Prayer Eternal rest grant unto them, O Lord, and let perpetual light shine upon them. May their souls and all the souls of the faithful departed, through the mercy of God, rest in peace. Amen. All Souls Day reminds us, my dear brothers and sisters, that death is not the end, but a transition to a higher realm. May our dear departed find eternal peace and happiness. The souls we have lost may be gone, but they are never forgotten. All Souls Day, 2nd November 2024. Let us pray. One now, Father, one Hail Mary, and glory be for the departed souls of our beloved ones. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. My dear friends, if you have not subscribed to our channel, please to subscribe, like, share, and comment. Thanks for watching. God bless you.